Hello everybody, I'm in the little wood, also known as Martin, welcome back to the channel and no time to dilly dally, you want that blockbuster skin just as much as I do, so here's how you do season 4 week 7 inside of Fortnite. Challenge number 1, just like Minecraft. It's probably the most disrespectful way to finish somebody in Fortnite. They're lying on the ground, you don't even try to dance over them. Instead, you bring out your pickaxe and you swing at them until they are gone. Go ahead and do that for 250 damage and challenge one is complete. Challenge number two. Would you like some popcorn with that? As always, the second challenge is a chest hunt. So this week, we need to make our way to the northeastern corner of the map up to the recently added Risky Reels. Now, the map is ever-changing, so I'm not going to talk about the ones in the very central part around the crater, but I'll talk about all the other ones which don't seem to be moving anytime soon, starting off with the northern building. First off, you can find two chests, one on each end of the rooftop. You'll find another one on the ground floor, not in the green screen room, the one next to it. And directly above that room as well, you should find another chest on the second floor. Just outside of there to the east, there's a bus that's chilling out. On top of that, you can usually find yourself a chest. If you move over to the eastern side of Risky Reels now, you'll see that long, large building. I guess it's kind of like a barn, really. It's got a white top. Inside of there, you can usually find two chests. Make your way to the south now, and right behind the cinema screen on the raised staircase, you can find a chest there. All the way on the opposite side of Risky Reels in the western building, you're going to find one inside of the bathroom and another inside of the roof. Ever so slightly north of there, so it's in the northwestern section of Risky Reels itself, you will find what looks like the ticket booth. They drive through, they go, I want to watch batman please you give them five dollars they give you something out the chest challenge number three om noms everywhere oh. so in recent weeks we've seen the addition of both apples which grant you hp upon consuming them five hp per one and we've also seen an equivalent for armor as well in the shape of mushrooms go ahead and collect 20 of these across lots of different games and that will be challenge number four completed Psst, you could do it with hot rocks too challenge number four Goal! It now makes sense to me why they went ahead and changed the challenges to a Thursday. They wanted to line up the World Cup beginning with this challenge right here. Get yourself over to the three different football pitches and score yourself a goal on each of them. Now, if you're unfamiliar with where these are, you should probably know them by now. But if you go west of Tilted Towers, you'll find an indoor football arena just there. Then after that, it's basically a straight shot north. Keep on going up until you reach Pleasant Park. And on the southern end of that, there's a football pitch there. Then continue that line north until you reach the newly added football stadium. Get in there, score a goal, do your country proud, son. And that is another challenge finished. Challenge number five, the mysterious treasure map. Now, the reason that I say this is mysterious is because this is the first time when Fortnite challenges have been leaked early where the title was incomplete. Originally, it said, complete the treasure map at dot dot dot. And that had us all excited it would be a new location. Turns out it's literally just Pleasant Park. The raised earth slash hill that is just south of that, you can find it there. Challenge number six. Is this supposed to be hard? I don't know how this constitutes as hard, but jump into the game, grab yourself any kind of assault rifle. It can be the Famous, the Burst, the regular old AR, the Scar, whichever one takes your fancy. Go ahead and get five kills, and that's that one done. And finally, challenge number seven. He looks a bit shifty. Pretty simple order once more. Get yourself over to Shifty Shafts, get yourself three kills, and that is this week's challenges done. Finally, after seven weeks, the egg has been cracked open. Well, by egg, I mean meteorite, and inside, there isn't a kinder surprise, but there's a blockbuster skin. Yeah, I, I was a little bit disappointed too. Although, it does come with an interchangeable face, which is pretty cool. It's one of the few skins that can do that so far, alongside Carbide and Omega. And as well as that, it has got the very cool cape known as the Offworld Rig. If you've completed all the challenges from the last seven weeks, then that should be in your locker, ready to play with right now. And if you want the free battle pass tier, just hop on top of that very same pod and you'll find it right there. So there we go, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. If you did find this video helpful, as always, I try to make these videos very to the point, very concise and very clear visually. If you do enjoy that, leave a like on the video. Consider subscribing to the channel. As I plugged last week, I've got my brand new Fortnite Raps channel where I'm posting new music all the time. And a final question just before I go as well. How do you think Season 4 is going to end? And what do you think Season 5 is going to hold in terms of skins, themes, anything like that let me know in the comment section below what you're thinking what rumors you've heard and i will see you all next time bye bye